tonight is the night that we are at the Oxmoor Mall in Louisville, Kentucky. This is the mall area. It's pretty cool, if you ask me. They've got a lot of games, stuff like this. We're just, but tonight we're here for Auntie Annie, so we'll be back in a minute. Kind of cool. You can see how it's made over here. And here's the selection. Looks like they got a cinnamon one. Some new items. They got, um, I'm not sure if that's a savory one. They got some sweet ones. They've got the hot dog ones. I like to call those ones pigs in a blanket. And then the traditional. So we'll see what we're gonna do here in a second. Yeah. All right. Well, we decided to go with the classic. This is the classic. And honestly, I was a little bit disappointed with the price. If you can guess below before I mention how much you think this cost this cheese dip, this was $1.19. This is $1.19. Look at that. This is a... Uh, 1.4 ounces, so $1.19 for that. So it better be good. This was $6.59, so altogether it was $8.25 for both of these. So we'll try them. I've never had Auntie Annie's before. This is my first time ever. We're here at Oxhorn Mall. Don't forget, like, subscribe, and share this content with a friend if you like it. Comment below if you've ever been to Auntie Annie's. We'll head and see what this tastes. We'll try one of them. We'll try one of them naked, actually. We'll try the first one naked. Honestly, I was expecting it to be a little bit saltier. It's not bad. Not bad, not great. Um, I think I need some cheese. I'm trying some cheese. Wow, okay. This is that cheese whiz you get. Really cheap cheese whiz, um, but yeah, I don't know. I mean, I think it's been sitting down for a while. <laughs> Not super fresh, but would I get them again? No. Probably try something different on the menu. I would probably try the uh, sweet items, but so we're gonna finish up this bucket. Try one more. We'll be back in a minute. Five bucks. And I thought I would start the review over here. You can check out. Um, Oxmoor Center is where we're at. We got plenty of if you like ketchup or mustard on your pretzels. I'm not sure who would, but some people might. We got plenty of napkins, and it looks like you come over here and you can kind of see the operation. Um, blue raspberry, lemonade, strawberry, and mango. Lots of drinks. I wanted to get a that's a new menu item, I believe. Confetti nuggets, butter cream rolls. They got a traditional menu over here. I'm not really sure what I'm gonna get, but they've got frozen lemonades, lemonades, other drinks, and they pair pretty well together. So, pretzel dogs. They've got quite a bit. We'll be back in a minute when the food gets here. And I mentioned earlier, when it comes to these chains, I got a lot of haters talking about the chains. This, this is a, you know, I go to locally owned establishments and what caught my eye was look at this bucket. You can come here and spend $33 on a pepperoni bucket. It's kind of crazy. All right, we'll wrap things up here with the final thoughts. Um, yeah, Auntie Annie's. I should have joined the rewards club because I got something for free. Probably next time I wouldn't get the savory. I would probably get this one of the more sweet cinnamon ones. I think I might have ordered wrong. Um, but all in all, you know, it was, it was decent. I can't say I highly recommend it. It probably satisfies a certain craving. You know, if you're looking for something savory to snack on while you're shopping, it's probably a good item to get. But I probably won't come here again and order this item. So with that being said, like I said, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment below. Um, share this video with a friend. We'll see you next time.